Hello everybody, I am coming at you today. It is Sunday, May the 19th. I hope everybody has had a wonderful week and here we are at the beginning of another week. All right, people, well, I am here to drop in and say hello and hopefully bring you along with me on this wonderful Sunday that is going to absolutely be a fun day. All right, people, and so what do I normally do? Well, now you know. It's t-shirt time! All right, people. Here is my t-shirt that I am wearing today. And it says, pretty is a gift. Beauty is what you do with it. All right? All right? How you like that? <laughs> and so we bring it back where? To my face. All right. As you all know, everyone is beautiful. You guys are beautiful to me. Now, would I watch you if you wasn't? <laughs> so anyhow, I wanted to come at you guys. Um, I, I have not done my Crunk Friday for the last two weeks. Forgive me. But I do have a song that I have been listening to all week since I heard it. And I want to play a snippet of you of it for you right now because I believe that we can all relate okay parts of the song you know I don't agree with but the main verse is what I'm talking about so let me go ahead and pick up my phone so I can what let you hear a snippet of it all right so I've got it ready so here we go now I you know I like to join in so just watch me okay <laughs> <laughs> yeah, people. I hope y'all can hear that. Break me down, I'ma go harder. You try to break me down, I'ma go harder. You try to break me down, I'ma go harder. You try to break me down, I'ma go harder. Y'all know what I mean. There's some people that try to break you down. But y'all, you gotta keep on moving forward. You gotta press in harder. You gotta go harder sometimes. And I tell you, I have been really feeling that way lately. Like, hey, people try to break you down. Situations try to break you down. Circumstances try to break you down. But you have to go harder. You have to press in for what you want. And I'm telling you, that's going to be my tip for today for you guys. And it should be a model for everyone's life. That you've got to go for what you want. And sometimes you have to press your way. No matter what obstacles come your way, you have a few hurdles. You have to jump. You jump those hurdles and you keep on moving. All right? Try to break me down, I'ma go harder. They try to break you down, y'all go harder. I thought I would share a piece of that with you guys. So, all right. Hopefully, um, I'll be sharing more of my day with you today. So, what? All right, people. See you back in a bit. Well, hello, everybody. I am sitting in my vehicle. I have finally gotten out the house, and it looks like the sun, let me switch around, is uh, trying to come out, which it needs to. Um, anyhow, did y'all hear this song on the radio by, um, by Drake? I like that. No new friends. I'm waiting on my son to uh, actually get his hair cut so just wanting to come and give you a little quick shout out while I sat in the car so here's my shout out to you guys Woohoo! Woo everybody so I got up my car people to uh, go into food line and so I could grab me um, a few things that I needed for my seasoning and um, this parking lot is busy. I guess it would be because it is a store parking lot. But let me show you what I did get. Lately, um, people, I am into uh, drinking teas. And um, I have really been on a tea kick lately. And um, T 
tea is uh, very very good for you um, except for I ha I happen to really like um, um, caffeine drinks so coffee really is my favorite and when I do pick out my teas uh, a lot of times I will not pick out the caffeine free because I just like to get caffeine in my stuff although that might not be good for you but there are a lot of herbal teas that do come caffeine free for those who do like to have caffeine free items and can't do caffeine um, the teas come with a lot of antioxidants that are really good for you so that's another good thing and not to mention it has a great taste and you can get all kinds of flavors um, I did get this um, six assorted uh, teas and in this box, this is by Bigelow, you get Lemon Lift, which is a lemon flavored tea. You get green tea. Uh, you get, what kind is that? Constant Comment, which is a tea flavored with rind of oranges and sweet spices. You've got Earl Grey, which I have never tried. So that will be a new one for me to try. It's black tea, which natural oil of bergamot. Um, it has... Uh, plantation mint which is a spearmint flavor I know that I like that and then it has English tea time so that'll be a good one which is basically black tea all right I did get another kind which I know is going to taste good I got the mint medley tea and um, it's a blend of spearmint and peppermint and of course um, if you guys did not know I love to season my um, green beans and I like to do it without actually using um, pork and putting it in there um, I do like to get do some things healthy and that way you eliminate a lot of grease that comes off of um, putting like grease in your stuff from um, where you cook some bacon I know people use that to put in their um, greens their green beans so I use this Goya and it is um, a ham flavored concentrate so it gives the taste of ham without actually putting it in your um, food. And while I'm also sitting here, people, I decided that I would get me a naked drink while I'm still waiting on my son. This is the Green Machine. And um, it contains apples, banana, kiwi, mango, pineapple, um, something called spirulina, and chlorella, and broccoli, which we are familiar with, spinach, blue green, green algae, garlic, barley grass, wheat grass, ginger, and parsley. So, let me pause this for one quick second while I taste it to let you know how it tastes. Okay, so I have tasted my green machine naked drink and it actually is very sweet, guys. So, um, you guys might want to try it. This makes the second one that I've actually had. I believe the other one I had was more of a fruit natured one. Um, but this one is actually very tasty so you guys might want to try it. It's like $2.99. It's a little expensive but um, I've missed out on making my juices lately but tomorrow morning I'm planning on getting back on track and making me um, more of a carrot, uh, beet, um, apple type blend juice for, uh, for tomorrow. So I'm going to get back on track tomorrow and I'm going to try to start eating a little more healthy. I had a gentleman in the store say, do you work out? Ha! <laughs> Uh, no, I don't work out. I have a gym membership that I'm paying for and don't go. And I have a trampoline and a, a stationary bike that I don't ride. So, yeah, I'm going to have to get back on my exercise flow. Uh, so, I'll let you know how that goes. Maybe this week I can get back in the groove and maybe let you join in and see me. So, we're going to see. Okay, people? All right. Hello, everybody. I am back and I am back at the house and um just coming back to chitter chat some more with you and hey listen um you folks that do twitter um i'm trying to get more involved with twitter uh these days so i really one of my favorites that i like on twitter is actually um russell simmons he has some really 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 good sayings that he makes and um I wanted to just share one and it goes along with my uh, song from earlier go harder and I'm really I tell you guys I'm really on that now and I'm all about uh, trying to be happy and um, living my life um, in such a way that it brings happiness to myself and it, that it also um, that I see improvements in my life so um, 
One of these that came from Russell Simmons that I actually uh, clocked it in as a favorite um, is be encouraged. Stay on your hustle. You can't fail until you quit. So we don't have any quitters here, right? I'm not a quitter. You're not a quitter. So that means what? We are going to win, right, people? And um, let me um, see some other favorites because I'm really, I'm really into Russell Simmons. He's really great with that. And not only that, um, if you guys are do not have Reverend Ron as one of your um, one of yours, here is another one that I favored today. This one is by Reverend Run. Of course, you know they're brothers. Um, but this one says by Reverend Run at Rev Run Wisdom. It says your happiness matters. You cannot please everyone. He who trims himself to suit everyone will soon whittle himself away. So we don't have any people pleasers here, right? We certainly want people to feel good about things that we might say or do for them, but we definitely don't want to uh, try to please people to the point of our own detriment. Okay, we sometimes have to put ourselves first and that's not being conceited. That's called loving yourself. Okay, sometimes you have to love yourself enough to say no to some folks and um, know when to hold them and know when to fold them. <laughs> All right. Okay, people. Well, I am going to absolutely go ahead and enjoy the rest of my day. I have left you guys with some good tips and I hope that you utilize them. Be yourself. Be happy and go after your dreams. Go after what you want. Go hard. All right. Sometimes you got to press. So I'm encouraging you to press. All right, people. I will absolutely see you in what the next video. Thanks for watching. See you later.